What's going on guys? I'm Domi and today I'm uh, back at you guys with another episode of Domi's Insight. Um, so this is going to be our Strafe vs. Infamous uh, series that we played a few weeks ago. Uh, this was in the PGL Pro Circuit uh, tournament uh, for Top 16 and um, I got a lot of requests to upload this so uh, here it is. Uh, spoilers. We do lose this series 2-0. Um, sorry for that, but some people only watch this, uh, you know, for to see teams win. So just a quick heads up, we do lose these series. Um, but these are very good players. They're top pros. Uh, they got second at AGL8. Uh, so it was definitely a good series regardless of the loss. Um, you know, as I always say, winning is teaching and losing is learning. So... You know, I analyzed these games thoroughly and, and learned a lot from them, so hopefully I can then pass that down to you. Um, that's why I'm commentating over this. I, I would have just uploaded them by themselves, but I thought it would be better uh, as a Domi's insight, even though uh, we're losing. So uh, let's go ahead and get this started. Uh, we're playing here on Abandoned TS. You're going to see us immediately go for overshield and then try to set up top gold. So you'll see me doing this quick jump off the pillar, uh, forcefully getting shot, so it takes me an extra second, but I grab that OS at 53. Again, I'm, I'm vocalizing, making sure my teammates know when I picked up that overshield uh, so that we can get it again next time. Uh, lift sounds kind of spooking me out, firing a quick shot right there. I'm getting call outs, uh, main ramp and tree. So I catch lethal off guard right there, end up getting the punch, and uh, that works out. And now we're up 4 2, and we're going to be trying to get complete top gold control which right now uh, it ends up working out for us uh, so I hear that lift noise on top gold but I also get a heads up that someone's on magic I uh, don't see him so I start shooting Ryan noob um, but then I do get taken out by a back smack so I don't know where Ryan noob was but uh, that was a good play by him so I see him on ring 3 right there perfect nade getting the clean up in the team shot uh, Goofy catching me off guard on ring 3 and you can see that they're set up on ring 3 and gold side of the map or excuse me purple side of the map um, Ryan Noob trying to spawn kill me right here but I'm not going to let it happen I'm going to try to stay alive and, and regenerate I'm calling out to John who ends up cleaning him up uh, so good play by us right there right now they have gold control and we're trying to get that from them uh, I, I get a heads up that Goofy was one shot but I don't end up getting that I get team shotted uh, so right now it's 12-8 in their favor, and we are trying to get gold control, which is uh, crucial to winning on Abandoned Slayers. So we need to get up top. They're setting up on top, on, on purple, and we're kind of stuck down low, which is never really where you want to be. So we're going to try to get up top here. Um, I'm seeing this guy. I hear his shots coming from Dark Forest. Not going to end up uh, getting that kill. And I see Ryan Newt up on ring three, but... Uh, unfortunately Lethal was also there backing him up. I didn't know that so uh, I ended up getting cleaned up but we do manage to get that assist right there. Uh, not down by too much at this point, only five. Um, again Lethal catching me off guard right there while I was recovering from that jump. Uh, and He's chasing me, I'm trying to get away but it's not gonna happen. Lethal uh, predicted where I went right there. Um, and they still have this gold control at this point. Uh, but we are currently trying to get that back. Uh, you'll see us pushing up here. Uh, I see Lethal. I get the nice three perfect shots, clean him up. And Ryan Noob shooting me in the back from ring two. I'm trying to stay alive as long as I can. Nades are pushing me out, and uh, I get cleaned up by Dark Forest right there. So right there, we just got put all four dead. So not the best scenario. Um, they're all on ring three, just collected uh, and spawn killing us. Uh, so there's really not a lot we can do at this point. Um, but, you know, we're, we're still going to be trying to get top gold. And you'll see me pushing up through blue cave right now. So I'm going to take a few shots right there and, and go ring two. I know there's guys above me, but, and I'm calling that out. But right now, I'm just trying to stay alive and, and recover my shields. Uh, I get this flank right here perfectly. Um, end up taking out Rhino. I'm grabbing the sniper rifle. I'm trying to find Goofy, but uh, somehow that melee didn't connect with the kill there. But... Uh, so he's going to have purple control, and we are going to be uh, still trying to get this top gold, which which uh, Infamous is doing a really good job of keeping at this point. Um, 
So I'm gonna be pushing up. I'm, I'm hearing callouts from my team, and I'm really trying to just lock down ring three and get the top half of the map. Get a nice nade on Goofy. I put two people one shot right there. Unfortunately, I didn't have any help, and uh, I'm not able to finish any of those kills, and I end up getting taken out. And they're gonna have ring three control again. So we're gonna be coming up the respawn. OS is coming up really soon in a few seconds. Um, I ended up getting the nice cleanup kill on Ryan Noob right there. Uh, I'm getting more callouts, perfect callout right there, and I end up finishing off uh, APG. Uh, so good plays right us, and also we have over shield. Uh, we had that timed perfectly from last time, uh, and that was a great play. So right there, kind of unfortunate spawns. Uh, I get team shotted, and I didn't have any help. So we're going to be all collected on blue slash magic side, and you're going to see us pushing up. Um, John dropping a huge double kill right there, and we are going to try to attempt to uh, get control of top gold. So I'm just right here, kind of looking around and scanning. I see Ryan Noob down there. He was shooting, and I uh, get a pretty nice nade on him, but I get cleaned up by lethal by a snipe shot. Um, <laughs> so that was a pretty good play on his part. Right now, Ryan Noob actually only having three kills, but probably has a crap ton of assists, uh, helping his team in a different sense. But. We're going to still be trying to get this top gold. I get a pretty nice pre-nade on Lethal, and <clears throat> me and Table get a nice team shot on Goofy right there. Still not able to control gold, though, um, as Infamous is, was doing a great job of doing that. Um, I get a perfect four on Goofy right there, but I get cleaned up. And they're really just locking down the top side of the map. They're locking down top gold, and they're locking down ring three. And and even you see APG and Lethal right there pushing out even as far as main ramp, but it doesn't really work out for them. We take them both out, and I back uh, Goofy off of Purple Plat right there. Uh, so we know this game's wrapping up, so we're trying to slow it down as much as possible. But you know, you can only really do so much in this at this point in the game when it's it's this late. Uh, but we're just trying to draw it out as long as we can. Not really challenge anything because uh, we don't want them to get those final kills. So I'm just kind of waiting on main ramp, trying to draw things out as long as possible, and I'm trying to stay alive as best as I can. Fortunately, that nade is going to hit me pretty hard, and I managed to clean up APG while I'm one shot. I want to talk about that play a little bit, because uh, it was a very good play. Um, so right here I'm one shot, and you see I'm hiding on main ramp, and there's a guy, ring four, right here. Um, so I know he's there, but... I'm not challenging, but I'm going to get hit by a nade. But I know, even though I'm one shot and I'm trying to stay alive, I know that APG is here and he's focused on my teammate who's hard lighting. Uh, I know he's not focused on me whatsoever, so I'm going to try to help out my teammate as much as I can. And I managed to take them out with uh, perfect shots right there. <laughs> so, basically, even if you're one shot and you're trying to stay alive, if some guy's not really looking at you, you can still help your teammates, and it's a huge part of Halo, doing the most you can uh, while you're one-shot. You don't, just because you're one-shot doesn't mean you have to hide in the corner, you still want to be helping your team as much as possible. So right there, I kind of get caught under Purple Bridge, uh, get taken out right there, and that's going to be game 150 to 34. Um, so yeah, you know, they're a very good team, uh, second at AGL8, so can't be too mad about that. Uh, we learned a lot, and um, now we're going to move on to game two. Alright guys, so we're back here. Uh, game two, Haven Slayer uh, against Infamous. And uh, we're going to jump on board right here. And you're going to see me kind of pushing towards uh, closed and, and grabbing this railgun. So um, I'm going to be playing a little bit passive right now, not really trying to push out too much. Um, I know that they're going to be also trying to get this rail. Um, I know Ryan Noob's one shot. Somehow he doesn't die right there and he ends up railing me. Uh, so that was kind of unfortunate. Um, kind of questionable right there. Um, but right now I'm getting call outs at bottom close, bottom mid area. So I'm going to be looking to help Jake, but uh, they kind of got away. And I'm going to be challenging the top blue street right there, getting the nice trade on APG. Right now we are down six to four, and we just put them three dead for a second. Uh, you'll see me pushing up red and trying to help my teammates here. Uh, I see Jake just died, so I'm gonna be kind of nading and, but mostly staying alive. It's obviously way more important to stay alive than to get kills. 
Uh, unfortunately, uh, Goofy found me, and he got the combo kill on me right there. Uh, so, we're getting open spawns, which is never really the best thing. Uh, right here, I thought APG was alone. I didn't really expect them to be controlling top mid. Uh, I see a lot of teams, you know, controlling the street, so I kind of thought they might be on blue street. And so that was kind of a bad challenge on my part right there, but... Uh, I'm, now I'm going to be pushing through red, getting the cleanup kill on Goofy. And uh, I'm going to be getting hit by a lot of nades right now. APG, what are you doing, son? Don't chase me. I got them nades on lockdown. Uh, now I'm going to be kind of transitioning the bottom close because I know my teammate teammates uh, are calling out guys that are up here. And I'm going to be getting a nice uh, kill uh, with an assist from Jake right there. Uh, unfortunately getting cleaned up from Red Street. And they're going to have control of Mohawk now. Only down 16-11. Not that bad of a deficit deficit at this point. Um, getting a nice uh, team shot on Ryan Noob right there with John. And uh, I'm going to be moving over to Red to help table. Uh, teamwork so crucial on these Slayers. And really just, you really want to stick with your team and lay down as many team shots as possible. Uh, really, really, Halo 4 is more about teamwork than anything. Uh, individual shot skill has, has an aspect, you know, but it's not the end-all be-all. Um, really, if, if you... Whatever team has better teamwork is going to end up winning these games. Uh, it's not necessarily dependent on skill as long as you have it to a certain extent. Uh, so right now it's going to be 21-14. I'm going to be trying to help out as much as I can. Uh, fortunately I had to reload right there and uh, I'm going to try to be getting away from APG. Laying down a few shots but I'm going to get team shotted right there. And they're going to have control of the Mohawk area. And we're going to be down by a solid uh, 10 at this point. So I'm going to be kind of pushing up open. I get caught off guard by APG. Uh, again with the top mid control, um, they have it. And uh, getting open spawns are just really uh, trash. <laughs> so Ryan Noob's going to be spawn sniping me. Uh, but uh, I push him back. He's not really able to land anything. And now we're just going to try to slow this game down and, and collect on blue. I'm going to try to help out John as he's getting pushed uh, from Mohawk. And I get the nice call out and I clean up the guy behind me. And we end up uh, getting that guy on, on Mohawk dead as well. So, table's calling out this, this guy blue. And we turn around and finish him. And now we're also going to be getting pushed from red uh, street to Mohawk uh, right now. Uh, managed to stay alive. I see that there's two guys on Mohawk, so I'm going to be dipping out right there. Uh, trying to get behind him. I'm going to drop down and re uh, re-pop up behind him right here. Which uh, works out really well for me. We end up cleaning up APG and I getting shots on Goofy. Fortunately, they have top mid control and they uh, put a hell of a lot of shots on me as I cross that Mohawk area. Uh, Ryan Noob catching me off guard right there. I keep him one shot, but fortunately I was caught sprinting and uh, he cleaned me up. So we're going to be getting Mohawk spawns because my teammate's controlling blue area near Mohawk. And they're more or less focused on top mid. Uh, so I'm going to be laying in shots, getting assists, and I see that this new sniper is coming up, so I'm going to try to position myself in a spot where I can do it. Um, that looked like a four shot on Ryan Noob, but somehow I guess it didn't go through. Um, I'm going to be trying to keep him weak, but I'm getting uh, killed from Goofy down at Mohawk. And, and really, they have perfect control of this top mid area, and really you don't see a lot of teams go for this top mid control, but it's working out for them, and... and we're really just uh, on our toes here, trying to keep them off our streets. Uh, I managed to clean up Ryan, uh, but unfortunately I got called out beautifully, and Lethal just headshotted me like it was nothing right there. Um, so 44-31, we're down by a pretty big amount. Um, but I'm going to be getting bottom mid callouts, and I don't know why they were on bottom mid. We killed all, all three of them that were on bottom mid. Uh, unfortunately, Ryan knew about the R's me right there. Um, but I don't know what they were all doing. Kind of a bad decision on their part to go bottom mid. You never really want to drop down there unless you have to to get away. Again, uh, with the bottom mid thing, I pick up a huge double kill right there. Uh, so bottom mid control, really not the best idea. Uh, so I'm going to get cleaned up. And, and really, uh, this I'm not liking this bottom mid fight, but I guess they're just trying to scrap up those last few kills. So we end up finishing 50-37. Uh, uh, so not too bad, but... Um, they are a very good team, so you know you can't can't be too mad with that. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, 
I know it was uh, a very tough series for us, and we did learn a lot from it, and I hope you guys also, in turn, learned some things about uh, controlling the map and working as a team. Uh, so yeah, I got a huge amount of, of requests to upload this, so I hope you guys enjoyed it, and um, I will do another one of these tomorrow uh, with some gameplay uh, from Throwdown or something. Uh, I'll find some, some really good gameplay for you guys, and I'll upload that tomorrow. Um, but for now, uh, take it easy, guys. Peace.